Just to make this picture, I bought 180 LED lights. I saw an Instagram reel from FilmUp about making it rain with tiny lights. Of course I was intrigued and wanted to try this idea myself. I had no idea which lights they used so I hopped on my laptop and started to do some research. I found these tiny LED balloon lamps on Amazon, a perfect way to lighten up your party and hopefully also perfect to throw in the air to make a slow exposure photo. In each LED light there is a small piece of paper between the batteries. So you have to pull that out to turn it on and put it back in to turn it off again. That's a great technique but I can tell you that it gets annoying if you have to do that 180 times. Luckily Tse was there to help me but it still took us 25 minutes. You can recognize Tse of the Ready Set Brew videos I made where she brewed coffee in totally random places. If you haven't seen those videos I'll link the playlist in the description. Setting up the shot was pretty easy. We just went in my garden and I took advantage of the light from inside. So there was no need to set up additional lights. I copied the camera settings from the film up reel and went for a shutter speed of 3.2 seconds. ISO 500 and an f-stop of 8. Because I also had to throw the lights, I chose for a 10 second delay between pressing the shutter and when my camera starts taking the picture. Now the moment of truth. Framing was good, posing was perfect, so I pressed the button, got up next to Tse and started throwing the lights on her umbrella. She had to stand still for 3.2 seconds, but she started laughing at the end. Doesn't matter, still love the picture. Then you have to start cleaning up. That's a pain in the ass. Especially because we took the picture above a stone floor that broke a lot of the lights. So there were parts everywhere. I gave up the mesh bag technique and tried three more times with different poses. This is the next one. Every picture you see less LED lights because they kept breaking. It's kind of pathetic to see how many survived for the last picture. My conclusion, it's a nice creative picture, but I don't know if it's worth breaking 180 lights for it. Which ID should I try next? 